my cat had a few accidents and um, you know rather than considering uh, assuming its behavior you always got to get it checked out with a vet when your cat starts peeing not using the litter box appropriately so my vet checked up my cat out here's a little night the little power pack that this thing plugs into Let me get that out of the picture the vet has been after me to buy, you know, last couple times I talked to her, get a, a pet fountain. Um, this is the cat mate. Oh, cat mate, dog mate, what is this called? I guess it's called a cat mate pet fountain. And um, I've been kind of hesitant to buy one of these, even though my vet's been after me to get one. But it seems to actually work out quite well. The cat does drink more water. He's kind of fascinated with it. And uh, will sit there and drink almost scary amounts of water sometimes. Whereas before he wasn't drinking much at all out of his bowls, even though I try to keep them changed and fresh. So it is doing that for the cat. He is drinking more. Um, as far as noise level, it is very quiet. Um, if it was completely silent in here, you could hear it, a slight purr out of the thing. But it's very quiet. It purred a little bit louder when I first got it, and it kind of broke in and... Uh, quieted down and um, my refrigerator is running in the background so you, there's no way you'd be able to hear it. If it was completely silent in here you could hear it really slightly. I doubt the camera would be able to pick it up. So, so far so good. I bought a $30 model here, 30 something, I forget exactly, I'll look it up. Because um, it had five stars in the reviews and very few of them had five stars, most of them were you know four stars or so. And, uh, you know, I read the comments on a lot of them. That's what's nice about Amazon is you're able to, you know, really the best thing about Amazon is the customer ratings. And even if I'm not going to buy something from Amazon, sometimes I'll read the customer ratings. I got a little light here. You know, I'll read the reviews anyway just to get the ratings and what people think about it. A lot of times you learn, um, you know, pros and cons you hadn't even considered. Um that sometimes are a, a make or a, or no way, you know, on a purchase, you know, things I would have never even thought of. And someone objects to certain things, says, yeah, well, that would be a deal breaker for me as well. Or they mention an interesting feature of a product and it goes, wow, that really isn't interesting. Most of them don't have that, and uh, that's going to be really useful for, to me. So, yeah, um, the reviews are the best thing about Amazon. Anyway, the reviews said that the uh, metal ones tend to get limed up, and I got a lot of lime in my water. The uh, ceramic ones tend to get broken, and all being on the ground, they're likely to get kicked, you know, accidentally. And I said this plastic one's really the best way to go. So I'm trying it out. If uh, I'm going to take this one back down south where I'm cat's home a little more often, I'll probably end up buying two of these. If uh keeps going well. The only question mark is the filter and how much the filters cost to replace. You know, if I could make my own or whatever else. So that's the one question mark in the whole deal yet. Here's a little more up close view of the thing. Um as I'm taking it apart to take it home, um, to my other location, my other home. The uh Fill marks, the minimum and the maximum, are well marked, easy to see. I like that. And to clean it, you know, it just comes apart. I guess the pump's in the top part. It's the first time I've taken it apart, frankly. Not much to take apart, it just lifts off. So that's all there is to that. It's really easy to take apart and take this off and clean everything. That's pretty smart. Put that back together for now. And yeah, it's only been in use for a couple days here. Well, it doesn't help. <laughs> I never unwrapped the filter. <laughs> Didn't know I had to. I guess it just floated up and got out of the way anyway. Okay, well, we'll take care of that. I literally took it out of the box, plugged it in, and... Uh, started using it. Alright, 
So that's what the filter looks like, and I'll have to see what it takes to, uh, a little bit of carbon in there. I'll have to see what it takes to, uh, how much they are to buy, and, or maybe to make my own. Because there really is a stingy amount of carbon in there. I could probably do better. But, yeah, pretty nice for the money. See how it holds up, and, uh, Maybe buy a second one if I like it.